Stannis Baratheon because he's the one true king of the north. <laughs> Not the north! Westeros! What am I doing? Oh no! <laughs> Uh, yeah, I watch Game of Thrones. Yes, of course I do. Yes, I do watch Game of Thrones. No. Well, I first started watching the show back in 2011, the premiere season one, because all my fans were talking about it, I just thought it'd be something I'd like to get into, so. I started watching the show last year, roughly about August time. All my friends were speaking about it, so I just thought, what's the fuss about? And then started watching it. Sir Ilan, bring me his head. <laughs> Yeah, the characters and everything in the world is just so good and like engaging, it's immersive. I like it a lot and uh, I like boobs as well. That's my honest opinion, I like boobs. So. Compared to other TV shows, it's marginally much more successful. I mean, you just look at the ratings for the reviews, it's just like skyrocketing now, so. I'd say the target audience is uh, teenagers or to, like adults because they read the books back in the 90s, so it kind of appeals to them as well. Everyone talks about it and everyone gets their friends into it and stuff. And, like, I mean, even parents get into it as well. So. Right now, I think like, one of the biggest things, it might seem strange, is probably social media. Because like, everyone talks about it and everyone gets their friends into it and stuff. And, like, I mean, even parents get into it as well. So. It's really good. It's immersive. The characters are really engaging. It's just realistic and you can't really fault it at all. My favourite character is the small one, Tyrion, because he's awesome. Daenerys, actually, she's like the most fiery and sassy and everything. She changes the most from beginning to end. Stannis Baratheon, because he's the one true king of the north. <laughs> Not the north! Westeros! What am I doing? Oh no! <laughs> I'm doing the whole interview! <laughs> no! <laughs> Here's what I'm looking at.